GPT-5 is here, but what AI companies could do next is terrifying. So in my previous video, I talked about a new threat that AI companies are running into, which is dealing with a lack of new data to feed their AI models. And one of the solutions to let AI models get more data than what's available on the public internet is to have them join the real world. Now you might be thinking we're far away from that, but actually someone has already done it and it's a product you can buy right now. An AI company called Limitless has already designed a product that lets AI listen to a conversation and give advice based on on what the AI has heard. This product is already being used by real people in the real world. By the way, there's even a video on YouTube with customers talking about how the AI helped them in their day-to-day -day life. And it gives me Black Mirror vibes, to be honest. Now, the reason I bring this up is because not only has Sam Altman invested in this company, but it looks like this is the next move AI companies are going to make. They have two major problems to deal with right now. AI companies have spent billions to make these AI models, but they never made a physical product to sell to someone. And they also need more data to train sets models. And as I said before, not only has Sam Altman invested in this company, but he even partnered up with John Ives, who is the head designer behind most of Apple's products. You see, all of this leads to one simple conclusion. The next move for OpenAI and more AI companies down the line is to make a physical product that you agree to let spy on you. This is a two birds with one stone kind of situation, where not only do they make millions off a new product, but get massive amounts of new data to train AI models. Now, this possible product could be a disaster to say the least if it's handled improperly, because the fact is you can't control what information it takes without your consent. I mean, the amount of lawsuits with this level of personal privacy being breached is insane. It's basically everything Johnny Silverhand was warning against. A pocket-sized device with AI listening to everything you say out loud and using said conversation to get to know you better and get better at training itself. This could be where people decide, you know what, we've gone way too far with AI. Or this could be a situation of everyone checking the box on the terms and condition and then just moving Moving on. I mean, that's what happened so far with Limitless, but we won't really know until a major company like OpenAI releases a product like this. But it's pretty clear to me, at least, this is the next step for AI companies to make a product that can not only be sold, but can also take your personal information for free without you being able to do anything about it. So keep in mind that 